Hello everyone, I am going to show you how to get started with using GitLab Duo in the Visual Studio Code Editor via our GitLab extension. But first, I am going to take you through what it looks like when you do purchase GitLab Duo or you have a Duo trial. So this group has a GitLab Duo uh, Pro trial and it has 100 seats provision to it. That's typical for the, the trial. Um, you can see here that the way you provision Duo licenses is through this sliding button. So I am the owner of this group, so I have the ability to provision uh, users and assign them two seats. So if I you know, click this check mark, I can see two out of 100 seats are used and I can remove this just as easily, one out of 100. So you can manage who actually has access to the Duo features. So we see that this user does not have a Duo Pro license assigned yet. So first I'm going to install the extension um, as this user, John Smith, and then I'll see what it looks like when I do have a Duo license assigned to me. Okay, so this is what it looks like when I am logged in as John Smith. You can see that I am a developer in this group, so I don't have the same access to that panel with all the different Duo licenses. So I will go ahead and get started. I open up my editor, VS Code, and I click on the extensions. From here, I can search for GitLab. I'm going to select the GitLab work uh, flow extension and hit install. All right, now that I have installed my extension, I can go ahead to this Tanuki on the left side here and select that. And I can see that I can connect to GitLab.com with OAuth. So I select connect to GitLab.com with OAuth and I hit allow. And I'll hit open. You can see that um, the GitLab Workflow VS Code extension is requesting access to my account, and I hit Authorize GitLab Workflow VS Code extension, and then Open VS Code again. Open. I open up a file here, which is hello.py, and you can see that when I try to do a comment here, like writes a hello world function, this does not generate any code suggestions for me. Uh, this is because my Duo license is not applied yet. So let's go ahead and enable my access to GitLab Duo. So if I go back into my own review here, I can provision the Duo license by hitting the check mark, and I can just restart my editor. Okay, I restarted my editor, and now I'm going to do write a hello world function, enter. And now my code suggestion is working. So I can tell that it's working because I have this Tanuki with the stars that pops up when I do a suggestion via a um, comment to my file. So now we see that I have the full suite of GitLab Duo capabilities working for me in VS Code.